Hey everybody, hope you're all having a good day today, at least as far as Mondays go. You are about to watch my open mic performance from Lamplighter Lounge last Wednesday, April 5th. Um, I thought it went mostly pretty well. Uh, the audience was super reactive and super respon responsive uh, through the first half of it, and then in the second half of it, they kind of tapered off and seems like I lost them. As of recording this, I'm not entirely sure what happened. I haven't watched it back yet. Uh, but as usual, there will be no added laugh tracks, no change in the sound, except that I will likely run it through some filters to be sure it can be clearly understood. Or if it sounds good as is, then I just won't put any filters on it. Uh, yeah. In other news, uh, tomorrow night in Memphis at the High Tone, I'm going to be there for the open mic. At least that's the plan. I'm planning on going, and I'm hoping somebody will go with me so they can record it. Uh, if not, uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> but uh, I will go to that. By the way, I am releasing a lot of live stuff. I understand that in place of bandwidth comedy. I understand that maybe some of you may miss bandwidth comedy. Don't worry. It's not going anywhere. I just haven't had that many great ideas recently, and I'm trying to build my uh, live and in-person platform. So I'm just trying to get out there like I'm supposed to. So, um, yeah, that show starts tomorrow night, I believe at eight o'clock. Sign up. I don't know the details on. I assume it'll be at 730 or seven o'clock. I'm going to try and get there closer to seven o'clock. At least that is the plan so far. So, um, yeah, come on out and see me if you're going to be anywhere near the area or if you po possibly can swing that going to Memphis. Yeah. Um, other than that, watch this. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Be sure to hit that like button, share it with your friends, or if you hate it, share it with your enemies and ruin their day with it. Whatever will work for you. Let me know what you think, and let me know down in the comment section what other things you'd like to hear live. I've had three different things in rotation so far. I'm thinking about trying to add to that because it's more fun that way. So let's start the show. Respect on my band, please. <laughs> What's up, Memphis? How are y'all tonight? Woo! Good? Okay, good. Oh, man. But we've had some tornadoes recently in Arkansas, across the river, haven't we? Why is it? Well, I got you all here. I just want some insight if you can offer it. Why is it that every time there's a tornado or a natural disaster of any kind, the media has to go and find the most southern country hick redneck they can possibly get to talk about it without fail? You know, we have real, reasonably intelligent people around Arkansas, a couple of them. I don't get why we have to go and find Yosemite Sam every time a tornado hits the back door. <laughs> Probably because the reasonably intelligent people were down in their storm shelters instead of on the front porch watching the tornado rip apart Little Rock. <laughs> Just a thought. You know, every time I turn on the news after a tornado, I see something like this. We come to you live from Lepanto, Arkansas, with local resident Cletus Bodine, who claims he saw everything. Cletus, will you tell you, will you tell us what you saw? Why, well, yes, sir, I sure will. <laughs> I'm just sitting out here on the front porch, and uh, all of a sudden, all them clouds done float up together, formed like one great big old cloud, and it got real dark. Not as dark as this T-shirt I'm wearing right here. Believe it or not. Anyway, uh, I noticed in the middle of that big old giant cloud, it started kind of rotating. Like that. And I leaned forward in my rocking chair. By the way, it's the nicest little rocking chair. It says bow down right there on the front of it. Then you sit there, show off your family jewels, just like. <laughs> anyway, uh, that rotation, you wrote that, started moving its way toward the ground, and suddenly it hit the ground, kicked up a bunch of dust and dirt, and cow just flying, my dog went flying across the fence. I did what any good red blooded American Southern man would do. I run inside and grab my 12 gauge, and come back out, and I said, Get on now, twist him in deep, and I shot him. What do you know? That buckshot gun flowed down there in that tornado, went around, come back, went through a window, and took out my TV. <laughs> now I'm suing the National Weather Service for 20 million. <laughs> That's a word over in Arkansas there, million. M I Y I N, million. <laughs> it's one of those homonyms, actually, it's got the numerical like $20 million, or the version of one and one's friend, such as he's coming with me and you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
That's cool. Not a lot of people like that one. <laughs> oh, it's Wednesday night, y'all. We're halfway through the work week. We're almost to Friday. Y'all excited? Kind of? Not really? Okay, fair enough. I get excited for Friday, you know? Not everybody does. It's fair. Because they're like, I still gotta be at work on Friday. Well, yeah, but like, come on, man. It's Friday. It's not like it's a real work day. You know what I mean? Like, I don't even act like I'm working on Friday. You know, any other day of the week, my supervisor comes around and she's like, Bryce, you working? Oh, yes, ma'am, I'm working. I'm working hard. Wipe off some of that water. I poured it on my head to look like sweat. Not on Friday. Friday, she comes around. She's like, Bryce, you working? No. Sitting in the break room, scrolling through Instagram. Oh, look, 11 o'clock. It's break time. It's Friday, man. I'm not that dedicated, you know? I'm not. Say all that though. I, I really hope there's not like an ER surgeon in here that's gonna listen to this and take it all seriously on Friday. <laughs> that would suck. And whoever he answers to comes around, he's like, Dr. Bodine, you let 17 people die today. Well, I'm sorry, man. That band dude that opened my chat each Friday ain't a real work day. <laughs> we, just, we just can't tolerate that lack of effort. What does that mean? You don't fire me? Oh, God, no, Cletus, it's Friday. I'm not that dedicated, for God's sake. <laughs> That's all I got for you, Memphis. You guys are great. Thank you so much. My name is Bryce Lord. I'm on YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I'll see you later. Give it up for Charlie. <laughs>